just wanted to share with you the rest of the candles that I received. Now, if you've been here, if you've watched my previous videos, you know that I just recently shared a haul from Goose Creek Candles, these five candles that I received in the first box, but I told you that that wasn't all the candles I ordered. So, the rest of the candles came today, and I'm super, super excited. Um, so I want to share with you, I told you I had a bunch, all of the candles that I ordered. Now, I've been burning these candles, as you can see. I've been burning the limoncello. I hope I'm saying it correctly. Um, I've been burning this one here in the kitchen. And this is champagne bubbles. I've been burning this one in my office. So these are the only two that I've burned so far. So let's get right into this candle haul, you guys. So I'm gonna take my glasses off so that I can read the little writing. The first candle in this shipment is called Very Berry. Um, it's got blueberry in it. It's got hints of vanilla. It smells amazing. It smells really, really good. This is a deep purple candle. Very pretty and very, very berry. I love it. That's the name, Very Berry. Now this next candle it's called Soft Linen. Mm. This candle smells like fresh laundry with a hint of fabric softener. Just a light, crisp, it's called Soft Linen Breeze. It smells just like the name. I'm really going to enjoy burning this one. This is a bedroom scent for me. This is a lazy Saturday morning, candle burning, coffee brewing, relaxing and cuddling with the one I love type of scent. It's also a just clean the house. Everything smells so fresh. This is the candle I wanna burn type of scent. Soft linen breeze, very nice. The candles, what I like about this candle company is when you burn the candles, they smell like they smell when you smell them, right? They don't smell overpowering in the jar. And when you burn them, they're not overpowering. They're light and fresh and they smell when they burn just like they smell when you smell them in the jar. This is called Candy Basket. I think this is one of the ones that came around Easter time. It has um, different color Easter eggs on it. I don't really celebrate holidays. I'm gonna probably take the label off. Uh, I like to take the labels off because normally when I burn a candle, I'm burning them in some type of candle holder, whether it's like this or whether it's a clear something or, or another. I always burn my candles inside of something. So um, I, the labels easily come off. And unlike Bath and Body where the label covers the whole jar, this one section where you see the label, that's the only place that the, that the label is. Candy basket. It, it actually smells like an Easter basket. It smells really good. Really fruity. And like I said, not overpowering, not too heavy, just a really light scent. Grape soda is the next one. This is another purple candle, but it's a different kind of. This is more purplish. This is more, the very berry is more like a dark blueberry. This is more bright purplish. It's called grape soda. And it smells just like, I want to drink this. It smells like Fanta. Have y'all ever had Fanta grape soda? That's what this smells like. It smells like a Fanta grape soda. I promise you it does. I love Fanta Great. I used to, growing up, we used to go to the candy lady and that's what we would have um, by the drink was Fanta Great. <sighs> this is called a marshmallow, you guys. Let me tell you, I love, 
I hope the camera's doing this justice. This is a gorgeous gray color. This is a very trendy, everybody's house is painted this color type gray. Really pretty. The name of this scent is called Marshmallow. And it smells like you need some graham crackers and chocolate wafers, like to make, um, what do you call it? What do you call it, y'all? S'mores. It smells like some marshmallows you would put on some s'mores. So good. This smells so good. I'm really pleased so far with this company and the scents. I'm pleased with the way they burn. I'm really happy that I decided to give them a try. This is not a sponsored video. Nobody sent this to me and asked me to make a video. I saw these candles. I saw a couple of reviews on these candles and I decided to try them for myself. Jelly bean. Y'all, I love jelly beans. I don't celebrate holidays, but around Easter time, that's all I was doing was going to the store and buying jelly beans. This smells really sweety, fruity. Like, I'm so impressed that, that these candles smell just like what they say they are. It actually, I mean, nowhere else to describe it. It smells like jelly beans. Very nice. I'm going to put that there. All right. That was the first container. Let's go to the next container. Marshmallow bunnies. Now, this pretty blue candle... I don't know if you can see it. I'm going to bring it around and see if I can show you. Now, I know you remember this candy. Can you see it? This doesn't really smell like... To, this one is surprising. It doesn't really smell like those marshmallow candies that I see. This smells to me more like... A mix between the linen breeze candle scent and watermelon. It smells like watermelon to me. It smells real light and crisp and linen like, but it also smells like watermelon. Does this scent smell like marshmallow bunnies? No, not to me. But it's a scent that I would purchase again. It smells really good. Very nice. All right. This next candle is called Island Bliss. Look at that pretty blue color. I love it. Mmm. Island Bliss smells like a good smelling man. This smells like your man just took a shower and sprayed on a little cologne and he came out the bathroom and lit a candle and, and slid right under the sheets. Y'all know what I'm talking about. That's what this smells like. Island Bliss, ladies. Ooh, that smells good. Ooh, that smells good. That smells good. That smells good, okay? Got another purple ca candle. I love purple. It's my favorite color. Can you tell? I don't even know anything about this team. I like purple. So when my mother visited Minnesota and went to that big mall, one of the souvenirs she brought me back from Minnesota was a purple shirt because purple was my favorite color. Um, Beautiful Blooms is the next candle. It smells like lavender almost. Purple flowers are on the label, so it very well may be. It doesn't smell like uh, roses or anything, like you would think a candle that's called Beautiful Blooms. It smells more like a sweet lavender. It smells really good, really light, almost non-existent. I almost can't smell anything. I'm curious to see what it smells like when I burn. But it's really light, not like an overpowering flower. Really light, kind of a crisp scent. I like it. I like it. Okay, this black jar is called cotton. 
I got this because it said cotton and just like the soft linen breeze, I love a crisp light linen scent. This cotton smells again, almost cologne like a man, but a little lighter. Like not, it's not as po powerful as the Island Bliss, but it reminds me of a man. It smells like a good, a good smelling man. Like this is more of a cologne my man would wear to work versus he would wear home for me. That's what this smells like. Really nice though. I like it. I don't want these to fall and I want to make a cute pyramid. So we have two more candles and both of these candles are aromatherapy. This one is called Gentle Touch Vanilla and Rose Petals. And it's an aromatherapy candle. That's what it looks like. Oh, vanilla and rose petals. Now this smells really nice. It almost smells like a cherry blossom to me. Really, really nice. It has natural essential oils, rose, sandalwood, and vanilla. This is a soy wax blend candle. All of these are soy wax blend, by the way. I don't think I said that. Very nice. That might get burned next. Very, very nice. All right, this next one is also aromatherapy. It's called Refresh. Neroli, Citrus, and Blooms are the scent notes. It's called Neroli and Central with Natural Oils. So, Refresh. And they had different names. Refresh, Grace, all kind of things. I got these two. Gentle Touch and re Refresh. Oh, neroli. I don't know what neroli is, but I smell the citrus and the flowers like blooms. N a different kind of bloom scent than the rose, but still it smells like fresh cut flowers that, that you would have on your, on your island or something. Really, really nice. I like it. I like it. Look, listen, I am so pleased. I am super pleased with all of the candles that I got you guys. They all smell really good. I'm really happy with the choices. If I could have gotten all of the scents to try for you, I would, but um, some of them just really didn't appeal to me. So I got some that I like and some that I just want to try to have something different. Um, so um, would I recommend Goose Creek candles? Yes. I would. It's a soy blend candle. There, I, you don't have to worry about like toxins and stuff like that. Um, I do have one thing to say about the candles. I don't think I should burn me personally different scents at the same time because earlier today I had the lemon cello burning in the kitchen and the champagne bubbles burning in the other room and going back and forth. I kind of felt something right here. I think it was the different scents permeating together. So I like I, when I burned just the lemon set cello in the kitchen, I didn't have that problem. But today burning both candles at the same time and going back and forth between the two rooms, I guess burning hit smelling both of the scents at the same time kind of irritated me. But would I burn either one of them again? Yes, just not at the same time. So that was a lesson for me personally. Um, I have burned candles at the same time before and um, didn't recognize that. But these are a smooth burn, a different kind of candle, and I just can't burn them at the same time. But I will continue to burn them. I love them. I think they smell amazing. All right, so that's going to do it for this video. I hope you enjoyed the candle haul. I think that these candles are really good. I'm glad I bought them, and I'm going to give them a thumbs up. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video.